Hello everyone. Today, I would like to show you that how to create single sphere rubber flexible joint rivet family. In this video, I will use and load in the created PN16 flange rivet family which parameter controlled by lookup table. And I will refer those dimension in the picture to create the parameter. This is lookup table, CSV file. Its data are referred from the manufacturer specifications. I will use this lookup table, CSV file, to create the parametric family. There are DN50 to DN600. I will use this formula for default do not found. Before go to Revit, I would like to request to subscribe the channel and click the notification bell for the next video. Ok, let go to Revit. Open the new family. Select the generic model and open it. Go to Family Category and Parameter. Select Pipe Accessories for Family Category and select Breaks into for Part Type. Set and select the Class Number. And click OK. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 125 mm and create similar. Insert dimension and make equal. Insert another dimension and add parameter for OAL. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 150 mm and create similar. Insert dimension and make equal. Insert another dimension and add parameter for nominal diameter. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 2 mm and create similar. Insert dimension and lock it. This is created PN16 flange family which parameter controlled by lookup table. You can find and watch how to create this family in the channel. Insert and load this created family into main family. Align to the reference plane and lock it. Select the family. Assign the material parameter to flange material. Associate nominal diameter parameter to nominal diameter. Mirror the family to opposite side. Align to the reference plane and lock it. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 30 mm and create similar. Insert dimension. Select the dimension and add parameter for T. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 28 mm and create similar. Insert dimension. Select the dimension and add parameter for flange thickness. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 14 mm and create similar. Insert dimension and make equal. Go to family type. Click on manage lookup table. Import the CSV file. And click OK. Add a new parameter for lookup table. Select text for type and select other for group. Keep type and click OK. Add parameter value for lookup table. The value is CSV file name. Add formula for flange thickness parameter. And click apply. Add formula for OAL parameter. And click apply. Add formula for T parameter. Click apply and OK. Select the existing reference plane. Offset 75 mm and create similar. Insert dimension and make equal. Go to create. Select the revolve. Draw partial ellipse and lock to reference plane. 
select the ellipse and check circle mark visible. Align to the reference plane and lock it. Draw another partial ellipse and lock to reference plane. Select the ellipse and check circle mark visible. Align to the reference plane and lock it. Draw boundary line and lock to reference plane. Select the line and mirror to right side. Align to the reference plane and lock it. Go to family type. Check and play the nominal diameter parameter. Set the axis line and finish the revolve. Select the geometry. Assign the material parameter to rubber material. Check in 3D view. Go to family type. Click on the rubber material by category. Create a new material and rename it. Open asset browser. Click on Autodesk Physical Asset and select the plastic. Replace black color plastic mat. Go to Graphic and select Use Render Appearance. And click Apply. Check and play the nominal diameter parameter. Click Apply and OK. Go to Create. Select Pipe Connector and place on Flange Face. Select Connector and associate the diameter to Nominal Diameter Parameter. Set global for system classification and K coefficient for loss method. Select the connector and link to the each other. Save the family. Let test the family in this project. Insert and load this created family into project. Check in 3D view. OK, single sphere rubber flexible joint family creation is completed. If you like this video, please don't forget to click the like button. Thank you for watching.